Hey guys, it's Michaela, and today I'm going to walk you through a fix for when your iPhone is unable to be activated. It's pretty quick and simple, so let's jump in. There's a couple of different ways to um, fix this problem, and I'm going to walk you through the most um, common occurrences for it. Number one is that the activation lock isn't disabled. So basically the old owner of this iPhone um, had a lock on it and to um, make that go away, they're going to have to log in with their Apple ID and password to reset it or you have to go ahead and go into an Apple store with proof of uh, purchase of that iPhone and be able to prove that you bought this iPhone and that you need them to reset that factory setting. So that's number one. So the activation lock isn't disabled. Number two is because of the SIM card, it is not properly inserted. So make sure you are either watching a good YouTube video on how to insert that SIM card or go to an Apple store and have them insert it for you because that could be a main issue. Number three is that the iPhone isn't locked to a mobile server provider. So you wanna make sure that it is um, unlocked from a mobile server. So if you have Sprint and you have, and they have ownership of that phone, you have to have it fully paid off to go ahead and give it to somebody else to log in. So you have to make sure you call them, you have to get them to unlock the phone, but you have to be the previous owner to do it. You can't do it if you're just a random person who just found the phone. You have to be the previous owner to get the permission to unlock it. The third option is that the internet isn't, um, you know, working. It's a, there's a connection error. So make sure you try a new internet um, so you can go ahead and um, update it. That way you can't use your cellular data. You have to be connected to Wi-Fi. Um, and then the last option you can try is to go ahead and connect your phone to your iTunes. So what you want to do is go ahead and click quickly on the volume up button and then the volume down button and side button, hold those at the same time. From there, we're gonna go ahead and keep holding that and plug in our phone to our computer. That will bring up this restore button or restore screen on your iPhone. Continue to hold until that restore screen comes up. From there, you can release and then go ahead and look to your computer, which your iTunes will have then popped up. You can click on your phone and then go ahead and hit restore and that will restore your entire phone and be able to restart it down to its factory settings. If you guys have any questions on any of these or if you need further assistance, let us know in the comments below. If not, don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe.